So this is, the, this is the guy I was just talking about. And so the Michelin star thing, I think, is confusing for most people because we know Michelin as a tire company and the Michelin yeah, man. Right. Well, Michelin started their guide in 1900. Guide to the restaurants. Guide, of guide the world. to restaurants. And the whole purpose was to get people to travel to okay. great restaurants and to great uh, hotels. And then they give out stars or a half a star or some certain amount of stars. They only give stars. out full stars. So it's either one, two, or three stars. Three oh, stars being okay. the highest. Okay. And so to give you to give you some perspective, there are six three star restaurants in, in New York. And I think there are five now in uh, in California. And you have uh, and two in two. Chicago. And you have two and we have three two. star we restaurants. Have, yeah, I, 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 Jimmy, I'm blessed. Oh, sure. I have one in New York, per se. And of course, we have French Laundry here in, uh, in Napa Valley. And then you represented the United States. What's the name of the competition? The competition is called the Blue Coast Door. Teams from all over the country, or world come to compete. 20, 24 countries from around the world compete every other year in Lyon, France. The United uh, States had never won this before. We won, well, we won silver in 2015, but we never had placed at the top of the podium, which is gold. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank I you. Mean, it, was a, it was a very uh, a proud moment for not just for the team, but I think for, for the United States. You know, Donald Trump said we were going to start winning and winning and winning, and it turned out he's right. I mean, we really we started okay, with this. OK, so um, you're going, you made this big, beautiful platter as right. part of this competition, and you're going, you've recreated that here for us. We have, and, and you'll get to see it a little later. So this, what we're going to try to do is do one of the garnishes. So there, there's a total of four garnishes on this platter. And who decided that a carrot would be the thing that you would Well, make? You know, we, we looked at our garden across the street, French Laundry, and you know we grow a lot of really great carrots. So we wanted to be able to bring something uh, from Napa Valley to Lyon, France, and we thought that the carrot would, would be something that was beautiful. Do you check the carrots, or do you carry those on? Um, well, you know, we, we, we have to smuggle them in. Oh, so really? Oh, yeah, my goodness. So I don't want to get caught by <laughs> I don't want to ask where you smuggle right. them. OK. <laughs> Uh, so we don't have much time. I want to get you to work. Okay. Um, so we're we're gonna we're gonna actually turn the carrot and uh, we're gonna sharpen it. With, so this is much like a, a pencil sharpener. I'm sure you use the pencil sharpener when you. I have. In. Yes. Yes. So we want to take the carrot. You want to take your tool out of the end of your. Go ahead. Follow me. Okay. We're gonna push push the carrot in. On the big end. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Okay. Put it back in the machine. So a tool's back in there. Okay. Turn it on. Okay. 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 Now take your pencil sharpener. All right. Or oh. In this case, your carrot sharpener. Okay. Right there. Okay. Look at that. Okay. That's beautiful just sure. to start with. Right? You made this you got thing? it. Push it, push it. Is that it? OK, you're going to take it, it off. Turn it off. OK. Turn it off. Take the carrot out. Oh, look at, look at how pointy this. Pretty good. <laughs> OK. All right. Take that out. Take okay. it out. OK. We don't have much time. We're, All right, we're OK. Against the clock. I can't get it out. Okay. All right. You're, that's it. OK. OK. So now put it on your, on your board. I got it. Cut it straight across. Yeah, we're going to take our knife, our channeling knife, and we're, we're okay. cutting it to create a channel that we're going to remove and then we're going to fill it with a, a sauce, OK? OK. And that sauce is called a soubise. It's made with onions, sweet onions. And we're going to fill that with that, that little cavity. There should be a tool for this, especially like melon baller, you know, but <laughs> some kind of carrot channeler. OK. So you've got your carrot, you got your carrot channeled out. Right? That'd be a good okay. show, too, the carrot channeler. That's very good. <laughs> We go right with the Nat Geo channel. OK. OK, so we channeled our carrot. Then we cooked them. You see how we cooked them? We cooked them with some of the carrot liquids um, to give it some more flavor. OK, so we compressed it in a bag, cooked that. They're all cooked, so we're going to just go OK. All right, we skipped and, the whole cooking part. All right. Well, we don't, we don't, you know, we, have, we don't have, we're, 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 Is this available time. for eating? Or this is it? available for eating. OK, all right. We filled it with our soubise, as you can see. We've done that very cleverly. Mm -hmm. um, and then we're just going to trim it off, run it okay. right along there, right? OK. Got it. What is this Perfect. in here? This is the that, sauce? That is, that is the onion sous vide. You can eat that as well. OK. It's all edible. So okay. just, what we normally do then is we're going to glaze it. So we take our carrot on our fork, okay. put in our glazing liquid there so you get a beautiful shiny glaze on top of it, right? OK. Where do you get glazing liquid like this? We, we make it. Oh. We make it. Up. Oh. OK. OK. Oh, look how much better I was at doing that. You did it really good. <laughs> okay. All right. So then we have our carrot. We're going to pull out our third our third carrot from underneath, mm -hmm. right? Maybe I'll get a trophy. Right here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. OK. OK, now we're going we're gonna to make our tool. This may be the hardest part of the whole segment. OK, all right. Or maybe the hardest part of your entire life. I'm sure. Possibly. So yeah. you've got your tweel over there, which you've got your carrot on top of, but that's OK. Mm -hmm. OK, we're going to take our, this is pretzel. This is a pretzel dough. OK. okay? We're going to begin in our coronet, OK? So we take our coronet. OK. It's got a little flat part on it. Yes. You don't have to pick up the whole tray, Jimmy. Oh. Just, just one. I go 110%. Just, just, just one. Just one. 
Just one. Okay. Okay. And find where that little seam is. You take this. Okay. This is pretzel dough, huh? That feel, that seam, feel that seam on there? Yeah, I feel so it. What I want to do is just take it and just kind of indent it on that. Okay. And then just start wrapping it around. Mm-hmm. No one's ever going to do this, though, right? I mean, because at the end of it, all you have is a little carrot. All you have is a carrot that's wrapped in a pretzel that's worth gold. Yeah. Believe me. I can't do it. Yes, you can. Okay. And then that, then we take that. We put that in the oven. Did you mm -hmm. get it ready? Yeah, I oven. just moistened it a little bit. Close in the oven and get yeah. baked. Okay. What? Okay. <laughs> All right, yeah. Here, I got one. Right. <laughs> wow, look no, what I go. did, everybody. Look at how perfect mine is. Yes. Yes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, so you got that. So we're going to take our tweel off. And remember, there's a flat spot on it, right? Okay. So that flat spot has to go on the bottom of the carrot so that it can still maintain. Oh, Sitting thread in. it in. Right, there you go. So you just thread that right in there. Okay. okay. So we got our twill wrapped around the carrot. Look at how adorable that is. Right? Yeah. Isn't that perfect? Yeah. And then we're going to we're gonna final, I brought you some nourishment in case you were hungry. Oh, thank you, yes. Thank you. Um, oh, look at Team USA. And then we're going to take our little carrot rounds, again, which come from our garden. We're just going to start to garnish that. Mm -hmm. Slightly on there, mm -hmm. on there. Right, one there, maybe. The show ended like four minutes ago. I'm sorry. <laughs> and then watercress. Well, I'm trying to, I'm trying people, to keep you moving Nightline along. Nightline is on right now. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep you moving along here so we can get this done. Oh, this looks filling, too, you know? You can't eat too many of these. <laughs> and then... Oh, honey, what yep. did you make for dinner tonight? We have our carrot. Yep. Oh, I spent four hours on this carrot. <laughs> Beautiful. Wow, and look at how there beautiful mine turned out, too. Well I mean, done. it's almost. Oh, we gotta see the platter. Let's yes. have your team. So Bring out the platter. Team USA, the champion. Yeah. You've represented our nation well. You've conquered all these other stupid nations. Finally, we beat them, thanks to you. Well, that is something beautiful. What is this up here? It's the uh, chicken. So, That's chicken? At least in uh, veal sack. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. This is our coach, Philip Tessier. Nice job, who Coach. Won, who won silver in 2014. Oh, you won the silver. Our, our candidate, Matthew Peters. Matthew, won congratulations gold. to you. He's got a present for you. Congratulations to you. Oh, what is this? This is our team. This is this is our team scarf. Oh, the team scarf. Okay. Oh, yeah. thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Jeff Thomas Keller. Look at his spirit, just cuisine in your own mouth at Bouchon Bistro per se in the French Laundry. Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel. If you like that, click the subscribe button below, and good things will happen forever.